Hi there, it's Commander Davis. Um, so I think I've hit top speed. Um, if you look at my speed there, it's 2001C. Um, it took me quite a long while to get here, probably about 45-50 minutes. Um, I've been through almost uh, two loads of uh, super cruise fuel. Um, one thing I have noticed though is, despite the fact that I've travelled 0.19 light year from Mingrove platform where I set off, pretty much well every single distance um, is identical as to when I left at Mingrove platform, apart from Bixby Station, which is also uh, behind me. Um, so my boot is was 4.04 light years when I set off. I've travelled uh, 0.19 light years now towards Ibutis and uh, those figures haven't changed. So from there we can determine the uh, the skybox is fairly static insofar as uh, you exist uh, within instances um, around a star and you don't actually travel towards other stars when you are flying towards them, if that makes any sense. Um, if we just target Ibutis, <coughs> you'll see there that um, it reckons I'll get there in 17 hours, 14 minutes and 57 seconds um, uh, at this speed. Although the seconds countdown doesn't appear to be changing, so <laughs> that may be a bug. Um, I've got enough fuel for what each block represents about half an hour, so uh, one, two, maybe three hours worth of flying. Um, so there's absolutely no way I can fly between um, where I am at the moment and Ibutis under Super Cruise. Um, you've got to use the jump drive. Um, Still an interesting uh, interesting experiment. They say it takes an awful long time to get out here, and uh, I'm surprised by how many contacts you actually get to see while you're out here. Uh, maybe once every couple of minutes you'll see a contact go past. Um, I would have thought they would have made contacts very rare once you get this far away from, uh, from anything. Um, other than that, there's nothing much to, to see out here. But there you go, flying at top speed in Super Cruise. Cheers.